Yesterday, temperatures got up into the mid 30s. Our normal high for this time of year is about 36, 37. So we're running just a few degrees below the normal. Uh, highs were in the upper 30s and lower 40s just to our southwest of us. But if you're looking for a little bit of some warmer weather, well, we do have a big change. So uh, just a few days ago, we were showing below average temperatures continuing for a good chunk of March. Well, now the pattern has done a complete 180 and it's showing slightly above average temperatures starting to return into the area. Now we'll have to wait till about Sunday to start to see some of that. As for today, there is a cold front that has moved through. We've got a little bit of cloudy weather behind it. A lot of cloudy weather across uh, the northern part of the uh, really the United States, and we also have a larger system down to the south. This is bringing some heavy rains into the mid-Atlantic and even a little bit of some snowfall, but at least it is quite off towards our northwest, and we're not going to be dealing with any impactable weather for the time being, and that's really good news if you're going to be heading out on the road. Skycast is just showing partly cloudy skies sticking around here as we head into the rest of the day today. Then for tonight, we'll see the clouds cl uh, kind of thin off a little bit. We'll have temperatures dropping down into the teens. And then uh, for tomorrow, we'll have a mixture of sun and cloud cover. And temperatures will be a little bit cooler than what we're going to be seeing for today as some of that winds out of the northwest continue to surge in here. But perhaps a little bit more sunshine. And then as you get into our Friday, starting off sunny, but there is a slight chance that maybe you might see a few flurries in the afternoon as another cold front moves. And it's going to be this like up and down swing in temperatures for the next couple of days. 30s, 20s, 30s and 20s, 28 degrees outside the actual temperature. But with the wind coming in out of the northwest at 7 miles per hour, feels like 21. Our sunrise is at 616. We've got anywhere from the upper 20s in Ephraim to 30 degrees in Menominee. And 30 is really the only temperature of 30 degrees in a viewing area. But most of us between about uh, 24 to 29 degrees. Anago right now is kind of the cold spot at 22. We've got these winds coming in out of the west and northwest at about uh, 10 15 miles per hour and there is also some winds coming in out of the southwest but those are going to be changing out of the northwest as that cold front continues to move through and it will be a little bit of a breezy day. Uh, wind gusts upwards about uh, 20 to 25 miles per hour. So while the temperatures will be getting into the lower 30s, it's going to feel more so like the uh, mid 20s outside. So for today, getting up to 32 winds west about 10 to 20 miles per hour, partly cloudy skies for tonight will drop down to about 12 uh, northwest winds continuing at about 5 to 15 miles per hour. Tomorrow getting up to 23 northwest winds 5 to 15 partly cloudy skies continuing across our area and then we'll get up to 31 on Friday starting off a little bit of sunshine and then maybe a slight chance of a few flurries down to 23 on Sunday and then we start to warm things up getting into the mid 40s on Sunday Monday and Tuesday and it looks like as we continue on beyond that we will be sticking around in those 40s so maybe some spring like weather actually is returning finally I yeah. love to hear it Gino thank you I'm John